Now behold guys, this is the Persian ice cream right here. With the ice cream in the middle and the two wafers on top and the bottom, that makes it kind of like an ice cream sandwich. This right here is the saffron pistachio flavor. The most popular flavor historically here at Saffron and Rose, which is um, one of the very best ice cream shops in Los Angeles and possibly all of America, serving some really awesome Persian ice cream. Hey there, this is Steve from Rockstar Eater coming to you with another rockin' episode. I'm out here in Westwood and I'm not here today to cover a restaurant, but rather I'm gonna be going to an ice cream shop. This isn't any just any ordinary ice cream shop, but rather this is a ice cream shop that some consider one of the best in LA. It's a Persian ice cream shop. Have you guys ever heard of a Persian ice cream shop before? I mean, I haven't because I don't even know what Persian ice cream is like. I've never had it before. So at this one spot here called Saffron and Rose, which is in the Tarangelis, like the little Tehran area in Los Angeles, they have some of the best ice cream that you can find in the city of all different flavors. It has a rich history. It's very popular with the community and it really represents Persian ice cream at its best. So if you guys want to see what Persian ice cream is like, then stick all the way to the end of this episode so that you can get an overview of Persian ice cream, especially here in Los Angeles. And of course, if you're new to this channel, then please subscribe to Rockstar Eater because I release these food episodes on a weekly basis that you don't want to miss out on. So hit that subscribe button as well as the notification bell and you'll be getting these episodes on a weekly basis. Now it's time to get some sweets. Let's get some ice cream. So we're a family-owned business. Uh, I'm the third generation to be very involved in the family business. Um, we've been doing this since 1974 in LA. Uh, one thing that makes our ice cream special is it's, it's different from the you know your traditional American style ice cream. We make Persian style ice cream. So our best sellers are rose water, saffron, falude, very traditional Middle Eastern style flavors. Uh, we do everything with old family recipes homemade style, a uh, very unique product. Even the texture is different than your typical normal ice cream. You know, a lot of people say that they can't go back to regular ice cream anymore once they try ours. So we have many different people, many different walks of life, different ethnicities. They, they appreciate the product. It is something that's unique. It's something that's good. We, we use exotic, real ingredients. So um, it's kind of something you don't really find at, at a regular ice cream shop. So the reaction has been quite good. This is the star of the show. This is the saffron pistachio what everybody comes here for. It's the most traditional Persian style ice cream. Really, really nice. I highly recommend if you ever stop in LA and come into the shop, you gotta give this one a shot. Mm. Um, right next to it, we have the White Rose, which is just rose water. It's uh, another one of our best sellers. And then over the years, we kind of like got a little innovative and creative, and then we created a Pink Rose. So these are gonna be amongst our top three best sellers. Um, another really unique flavor that uh, is very, very common in uh, Persian culture is gonna be the follow day. So we're gonna track back over on the other side of the saffron. This one is not an ice cream, it's a slush. So it's more like a water-based, kind of like a shaved ice type of situation. Um, it's very popular in countries like Iran, Afghanistan, India, Pakistan, that region of the world. Um, this is one of our, this is our version of shaved ice. Mm. Yeah, so uh, if we wanna look on this side of the case, it's gonna be all of our fruit flavors. Surprisingly, the cucumber is our, is our best seller. Um, that's a really, really unique one that a lot of customers come here for as well. And then my personal favorite, or one of my personal favorites, is gonna be the passion fruit, made with real passion fruits. It's a little sour, a little sweet. Highly recommend that one as well. And then we have the chocolatey and nutty flavors on the other side of the case. Uh, a crowd favorite is the espresso, but if I can give my recommendation, the dark chocolate is where it's at. Nice, so this is like a waffle maker? Yeah, this is our waffle cone maker. We make fresh cones every weekday. It's when I'm working here. Yeah. And they are really good. You'll, you, I hope you try one of our cones too with the ice cream. Oh yeah, I definitely will. <laughs> Look at that. 
And then now you just have to shape it into like a cone, exactly. right? Okay, wow, it must be so hot. Yeah, we have to wear double gloves. Double gloves, okay. And then it just sits there for like a few minutes? A few minutes to let it cool down and then we can start serving it. Okay, got it. So you got like the wafer in the bottom and then the ice cream is on the top. Yep, and then finish it off with... Oh, no way. Oh, oh boy. That is crazy. <laughs> it's like an ice cream sandwich. There you go. That's yours. My man. All right. Thank you. So the first one I got today is pretty much the saffron pistachio, which I have also got in the other one as well. But this one is unique because this is like the Persian style ice cream with the wafers on the top and the bottom. You see, it looks like an ice cream sandwich, but that's the way that they eat it. And then the second one I got today has four different flavors. So this is the large one. I decided to get like saffron pistachio along with the pink rose and the cucumber which I believe is like that one right over there. And then the top is the taro, the purple one. So that's four flavors right there. And they do put like a piece of the wafer over here as well as that fresh made um, cone, the fresh made cone, which they were just making earlier. How exciting is that? Oh, wow. <laughs> That is so cool. It tastes just like cucumber. Wow. That's the sweetness of an ice cream. It isn't too terribly sweet. That cucumber flavor to it, really amazing. Like you really do taste the cucumber. It's amazing. Wow. I think I'm gonna also get some of that pistachio since I heard so much about it. It's like the most popular thing here at this place. Mmm. Oh, that pistachio saffron is so good. Oh, 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 oh man. It has like, you can taste that pistachio in it. Like there's actually the pistachio nuts in there as well. And then the saffron taste, oh, just amazing. So what I decided to do is to take off the cone and then there's like so much taro on top of it that I just like scooped up the taro and put the rest of it in this cone. So now I guess I'm gonna have a, a cone taro ice cream right here. Hmm. Man, that taro is amazing. Oh yeah, another knockout right here. Whoa, <laughs> it's like dripping. I gotta really be careful. And then the last one, I have to try in this cup is this pink rose flavored. This one I'm very curious to see what it's going to taste like. Definitely is not going to taste like chocolate for sure. Mm. You can really taste that rose flavor. You know what it smells like is when you go into like one of those like um, stores that sells those really nice smelling candles. That's exactly what this pink rose tastes like. That's like the feel you get when you taste it. So overall guys, it's really cool. I mean, this is really fascinating ice cream that I'm eating right now. It's very different. Like the flavors are very different. So it's not like your typical chocolate, vanilla, strawberry. They've got a lot of really like exotic flavors that are probably known all over Europe and the Middle East and now I've pretty much gotten a taste of what Persian ice cream is like in its regular form in the cup as well as the sandwich which is really new to me and it's pretty awesome. So yeah, my overall thoughts is I like it. It's really nice and um, it's very flavorful. So if you're in this LA area and you're looking for some good ice cream and you want to be adventurous to try Persian ice cream, then come here to Saffron and Rose because it's not going to disappoint. There's a lot of flavors here that you can choose from. But if you don't know what else to get, then just get what I got because these are the owner's recommendations. And this place gets really packed too. Like during the non-COVID days, they would have lines that would go out the door for like four stores down. 
And then the owners are, you know, the owner here is really awesome. The staff is awesome. And they would always recommend that you guys try at least six different flavors if you don't know, like, you know, where to start. So, you know, sample some good ice cream and uh, take your pick and just enjoy. All right, guys, so before I close out this episode, once again, I want to give an acknowledgement to Fred, the owner here at Saffron and Rose. So when you come into this place, look out for Mr. Fred here. Tell him you saw this episode and he's going to take really good care of you. Right, Fred? Yes, sir. All right. Awesome. Awesome. Then have a great day and I'll see you in the next episode.